apologize for this interruption to our regular broadcast. Jack Ryder is live from the Gotham Bay area with some breaking news. This is Jack Ryder with breaking news in the Gotham Bay. tells me that the Batman's car is still parked just outside of the intensive treatment building. Now... Oh, so the Joker's free again. Us. Not for long. Every thug, villain, murderer, and kindergarten teacher that isn't carrying out party orders should head there now and smash it to pieces. Sorry, sir, but you can't come in this way. It's locked down. Where does the door lead? It led to the old pump station. Warden Sharp had it closed down soon after he arrived. Said it was a security risk. Batman, you got out. What's happening back there? We got directed over here and then the radios died. They keep playing this damn tune over and over. Joker's in control of the island. He's responsible for sending you over here. How did he get out? I mean, you're here and... An Arkham guard named Frank Bowles betrayed you all. He broke out Joker, who killed him when he was no longer needed. <laughs> some loyalty. Do you need any help? No. You and your men are safer here. I'll find you if I need anything. Oracle, disable the Batmobile's countermeasure system. I saw the alert. What's wrong? Where are you? I'm outside the Arkham Mansion. Harley Quinn probably triggered the alarm. If she still got Gordon with her, he could get hurt. Okay, done. The Batmobile is still parked up outside the intensive treatment building in Arkham North. I sent you the schematics for the entire island. I've marked key locations like your car. Thanks, Oracle. I can't believe it. They killed Jackson. Stay with your colleague. I'm ending this. Now.
supply of explosive gel in the trunk of the Batmobile. I may need it. Harley trashed the car. Strange. This is Gordon's pipe. Barbara gave it to him. There's no way he'd leave it. Wild country. Gordon's favorite tobacco. Gordon's smarter than he looks. Left me a trail to follow. Oracle, I found a pipe. It has your father's initials carved on it. It was a birthday gift I gave him last year. There's no way he'd leave it. Exactly. He's left me a trail to follow. He's alive, Barbara. The security doors are locked. I'm going to have to find another way around to get back on Gordon's trail. Anyone seen the big bat Batman, what's going on? The crazies are moving towards the medical facility. Like what's Joker doing? He's trying to take over the island piece by piece. It looks like medical is his next target. Has anyone got out of the building? I saw a doctor try and get out. He was torn apart. Throw it in the water. He never stood a chance. You wait here. I'll be back. Jeez. 
Gordon. Wouldn't you like I'm to? I'm over know? here. Shut up! Ah, you crazy bitch. Harley! Ah! What's he doing here? It's too early! I'm sorry, Puddin'. Don't be angry with me. Mwah! Go, you little minx. I can never stay mad at you. Sorry, B Man. You'll have to find another way. Bye bye now. I want all the doctors rounded up. Search every inch of the medical building. I mean it. Search every room, every office, and every trash can. If another doctor tries to run and get out of the building, then you won't. I'll just flood the rooms with happy gas and leave you to die. there with the others. Move it! Okay, okay, I hear you. I'm going. Why does he need the doctors? I've got to save them.
find him! Oh, God. I found someone over here! Come on, wake up! Damn it, he's up cold! Leave him here! Spread out and find that bat! <laughs> Aging Dr. Bat! Aging Dr. Bat! Is there a Dr. Bat in the room? What kind of hospital is this? Looks more like a torture room. Hospitals always gives me the creeps. Joker, once you stop, I'm gonna do it. Anyone gonna help me? Hello? I need help here! You're feeling the pressure. Not surprised. I mean, you're stuck in a room. Your friends have been picked off one by one. What? Now, What's going on? it's just you and him. <laughs> Clear. You're safe now. I don't know what happened. One minute we were doing our evening rounds, and the next, armed thugs burst into the room and took us hostage. Did they have anyone with them? They took someone into the elevator. I couldn't tell who it was. They obviously didn't want to be followed. The elevator appears to have been powered down. You're going to be okay here. We'll be fine. What about the others? We heard gunfire. They could be dead. We should go and help. Oh, no. I forgot. Dr. Kellerman was in the patient observation room, and Dr. Chen went to surgery. And Dr. Young went to x-ray. Okay, stay here. I'll find the other doctors. I'm here, Mike. Hold still. I'll get you free. I'll get you out of there. We're gonna be okay. Yeah. <laughs> Patients, please remain calm and move slowly to their accommodation. Let me introduce you all to the sterling work of our new head of research, Dr. Penelope Young. 
Since joining our team two years ago, Arkham is now at the forefront of research into understanding. Batman! Don't speak. You're safe now. But, but it's a trap! I know. Just not for me. <gasps> it's true! You really are the world's greatest detective! How did you do that, Bats? Oh, what the hell? Get down there, boys! See if he can <laughs> detect being punched in the face! <laughs> Don't get too full of yourself, Bats. I'm just softening you up. Think of this as a preview to the main event. You'll see. I'm sorry. I tried to tell you. I couldn't speak. Relax, you're safe now. I can handle these low-life thugs. Remember, a happy patient is a quiet patient. Now we're finding the question debates about whether psychosis is in itself neurotoxic and whether potentially damaging changes to the brain are related to the leg. adoption of the Titan process. We must all thank our benefactors for this opportunity. We represent all medical specialties and offer a wide range of medical yeah. and wellness programs. You're gonna... Be Whining and listen good. If anyone goes near you without Joker's express permission, then I've been ordered to make sure you are taken out ASAP. Looks like you're a marketing ship. Gotta tell you, the boss is all over this job. Planned like a military operation. Friends on the inside and out. I am quite aware that this job, as you call it, requires friends. What I want to know is why you chose me. Did Joker specify me? Why don't you let me talk to him? I'm sure we can settle this. Lady, if I have to tell you once more, I am going to hurt you. You understand? Shut the hell up. Oh, please, no! No! 
What's going on? They were talking like they were in control. Is it true the Joker escaped? Unfortunately, yes. But not for long. I'd been studying Joker's case for months when he broke out. The Warden was very specific he wanted Joker cured. Bad publicity will affect his campaign for mayor. That'll be the least of it. God, I almost forgot. They said they were moving through the facility, hunting down the other doctors. I know. I've got one more room to search, and then all the staff will be safe. You stay here. I can't believe this is happening. There are still more medical staff that need my help. so-called super criminals who've been treated here. But that is only half the story. Our low security wings offer normal but troubled individuals a safe haven for who's the guy? We that represent means all someone. medical specialties and offer a wide range of medical, <laughs> and wellness programs. High quality of care coupled with Arkham Asylum's convenient location. We are voted to be the number one facility in the entire <laughs> And you are pioneering We believe that anyone can be here. Remember, a happy patient is a quiet patient. Welcome to Arkham Asylum. Ar Boss, it's done. The room is full of gas and Captain Hook is stuck in there. Thing is, Razor didn't get out in time. He's stuck in there too. Oh, that'll teach him to dilly-dally. Don't let anyone out of there. Next 
time, Cash. I'll just shoot you. I shouldn't have left intensive treatment. I would have made sure that freak stayed where he belonged. Patient interview 21. Patient's name is Edward Nigma, also known as the Riddler. So, Edward, Warden Sharp tells me you've been leaving threatening riddles scrawled on the asylum walls. Again. One would have to be severely paranoid to read threats into harmless riddles, Dr. Young. May I test you with one? Very well. What is it that walks on four legs, then two legs, and finally three legs? A human being. As a baby, it crawls on four legs. As an adult, it walks on two. And in later years, it uses a cane. <laughs> Good try. But the answer to all three is a baby. True, it crawls on all fours, but cut off its legs and it can only wiggle on two limbs. Give it a crutch. It can hobble around on three, you see? It's horrible. How can you even joke about that? Easily, Doctor. It's not my baby. <laughs> <laughs> 